What's going on guys? This is Matt Chinella, Marketing Manager at Before Benzel, hanging out with Scott Huber, Key Accounts Manager at Before Benzel. Today we're going to show you how to install an Abirob Air Cool Torch cable on a Fanuc Thruarm robot using the Abirob Cyclone A500 as an example. Now, following Scott's steps, we're going to begin by feeding the torch cable through the arm to the wire feed system, then putting the torch cable through access 6 of the robot, installing the insulator disc, then the front module, and then finally the swan neck. So, we'll follow Scott's lead and we'll show you how it's done. Alright Scott, so we've snaked the air cooled torch cable from the robot to the wire feed system. What are the next steps? So the next step is going to be take the back end of the torch cable and insert it into the wire feed. At this time, you want to make sure that your gas port is accessible to your gas line. Insert your gas line, put a nice um, little pressure on it, kind of put a tug on it and make sure that it's not going to come back. At this time, we're able to take and lock in the secure nut to lock the torch into the wire feed system. Make sure that we're tight we're off to the next step. Okay, Scott, now that we have the cable connected to the wire feed system, it's gonna be now onto the front module, correct? Correct. All right. So the next step after that, we're going to insert the cable in through axis six. At this time, it's best to move your, your faceplate of your robot in a position that's easy accessible to all the bolts. So now that we have axis six in position, we're gonna start assembling our torch. So we take the insulator disc, there's a dowel pin, that we line up with a dowel pin on the, on the face plate. After this is installed, what we do is we tighten all the screws into the face plate axis six. After we have all the bolts snug, apply your Allen wrench, torque each bolt appropriately. The next step we're gonna do, is we're gonna take our front end module and secure it to our torch cable. There's a dowel pin here. The cable does have a, a groove in it. You'll wanna line those up Rotate till you find the set screw, tighten the set screw, torque as required. Now we'll take the front torch module and we're going to locate it onto the insulating disc and put the eight bolts in. There is a dowel hole, we'll line the dowels up and insert and tighten eight screws. After the completion of uh, tightening up your eight screws, you want to go through, make sure all screws are torqued properly. This will maintain a proper tool center point. So at this point, we're going to be putting the protective sleeves on of this front module to keep dust out, Correct. protect the protect the wire lock, and then after that, it's just install the swan neck, right? Yes. Okay. So final steps, we'll take the protective sleeve. There is a, a clocking slot, also a pen up here. We'll line those up, install, turn. The next step would be to apply the threaded coupler. holds the sleeve onto the torch module. All right, Scott, so last step's the swan neck. Now, with the Abbey Rob swan neck, we used a soft key and a double key model on the front module. Tell me why that's important. So, the reason it's important here at Benzel, our keys are actually in the module, and our key slots are in the torch. What this does is, this is the weak point. So we allow the replaceable side of things to take the wear and not the torch module itself. We also um, use large, key sets with, with set screws on each one of them. All right, let's get it installed. So just a couple quick turns on the Allen key, a little bit of torquing. Yep. And, then just and rotate, rotate the cover away from the screws, so keep debris and everything out of your Allen set screws. Perfect. And just like that, guys, you've installed an Abirob air cool torch on your Fanuc Thruarm robot. If you want to see any more how-to videos, visit our YouTube channel or check us out at benzel havacorecom this is Matt Chanella with Scott Huber. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.